Hello guys, let's watch one of the tiniest maps in the game in the form of a standard battle. I'm talking about province, but the maps file is called Campania underscore big. Okay, so we are watching my friend Tanklet from the Stahl clan. Stahl, yeah. Playing my favorite of all time tank destroyer in the game. This is my favorite, my number one. If you would tell me that you have to choose one tank destroyer to play for the rest of your life, it would be the E25. Hands down. All out of all tiers. Uh, recently, one of my associates at my other job, my morning job, or night job, you can call it night job, whatever. Anyway, asked me, if you had to choose one tank, which one would it be? So immediately I turned around and I said, the tier 5 leaf blower. He said, no, I mean a tank. And I'm like, oh, that's a little bit of a difficult one. So I thought there for a moment. I thought, I thought, I thought. And then in the end I said, wait a minute, E25, ooh, nice shot right across there, over to that Hellcat with a double critical, he spots the SU-12244, starts shooting him to shit, he can't see him, he can't, this guy must have at least, I mean, my E25 has 70, 75% camo, I can't remember, this guy must have, yeah, if he has a good crew, it's somewhere there, but he doesn't have a camo net, so, no, he has less, he has like, maybe a 50 and those guys are on the edge of his white circle so they're never gonna see him and he has a little bit of concealment from the bush a little bit it doesn't help much because he's shooting from the bush not behind the bush do you guys know this mechanic let me show you what he's doing right here he has to be at least 15 meters behind the bush in order to receive all the concealment now that guy is gonna spot him I think yeah see you know why because even though the e, even though the Scorpion, that tier 7 American tank, turretless tank destroyer, is behind the bush, our friend was inside the bush. Now, how do you know when you are taking all the concealment, when you have all the concealment from the bush or not? What the hell was that? <laughs> there, <there's> a... <laughs> Did you guys see that? He is so short. The tank is so short that <laughs> there was a, there's a wall there. Let's take a very quick look. Yeah, there's a wall there. So, let me show you. Once the player zooms in, I'm going to show you. I don't want to pause and this and that. Even though, well, I can. Okay, there. There. You see that the bushes are transparent? You see, it's transparent. In order for you to get all the concealment, you have to go inside the bush when it's transparent, spot your enemies, back up until the bush becomes solid, aim at your enemy, and shoot. Preferably, if you have a Kamenet, you have to wait for three more seconds. So that you would... When your Kamenet engages, you have full concealment and they don't stand... Look, look, look. They don't stand a chance of, of shooting... Of detecting you so that they would shoot back. Of course, they could blind fire you. That's a different story. I've shown you guys in other videos how you can blind fire back effectively. You guys remember those videos? Maybe I'll make a special tutorial, but uh, we shall see. We shall see if I have time. Requesting fire at Cressy 2015. Oh, someone is blind firing his position. They know he's here. They know. There's an 88 above you, but he cannot spot you. And you cannot and you're outside his automatic spotting um, proxy spotting distance. See now they cannot see him. Ah, that guy's gonna spot you. I think. No, he has a tomato crew. No, no, no. One more shot. One more shot. Ah, he moved. Ah, someone else killed him. Okay, good. Switch his ammunition to regular. I love the fact that he's, he's switching his ammunition. He's not shooting gold like a like a mofo. And you guys, you know my opinion about gold spamming. Whatever. You can do it, of course. It's not illegal. But it ruins the game. It ruins the game for everyone. Oh look, it's an object 279E. Let's load let's load gold. Yeah. Maybe that's not a good example. Uh, but I have seen <laughs> that's ridic that is ridiculous. Each time I see that, that's ridiculous. He is so short, he can't shoot above. But he's gonna spot you. You haven't bushed yourself. Oh, he didn't? Hmm, maybe his Wow, nice snap there. 
I think he spotted you there. No! Ah, you had the opportunity to take him out. Okay, fine, whatever. You got the spotting assist, which is counts as half the damage regarding credits and XP. Did you guys know that? When you spot, you get half of the damage done counted towards you as credits and, uh, and actual damage. Of course, spotting does not win... Does not um, give you WN8, but who cares about WN8? Who really cares about WN8? Only stat patterns care about WN8. Oh, you're getting shot from everywhere, buddy. You're getting shot from everywhere. Got some, got some tracking that says the S51, and you killed him. There goes Violent Man 200. Uh, excuse me. There goes X Seb X, killed by Violent, Violent Man 200. Yeah, sometimes I get confused. Because I'm used to seeing that yellow thing on my screen when I kill people. So when I read the first name first and I say, oh, there goes this guy. And then I realize, wait a second, it's telling you who killed who. Poodle took out Jay Panther. This guy is, uh, he doesn't even know that you're here. What is he doing? Is he AFK? I think he's AFK. Yeah, he's probably quit. Or his keyboard disconnected or his mom called him to, for dinner or whatever. Or he just quit. Oh, man. Could have happened to a nicer guy. Couldn't have... Yeah, that's the message that I see. They're destroyed. Uh, and I get confused between the the orange message and the green messages sometimes. Like, it happens. We're only human. We all make mistakes. So how's he doing here? Uh, let's see. Is this guy going to come around the corner? Oh. Ricochet. Let's see. You can, yeah, you can. Don't go out in the open. Take out this guy first. He's, uh, he's by himself. He has, he has, no, he's, he doesn't stand a chance. He doesn't stand a chance. There you go. There you go. It was a one shot. Okay, now, what you can do, you can drop down the trees. Oh, okay. He decides to shoot him on the move. Hits him once. Okay, doesn't hit him the second time. He's moving in. There is one artillery and one medium tank left. The tank, the light tank just got taken out. There he is. Take out. You got lucky there. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, that's it. That's it. He's on a reload and the artillery is on a reload. The artillery has another at least six seconds to reload. At least. Bye bye. Oh man, what a round. What? Moving to support your position? For what? <laughs> For what? <laughs> Moving to support your position. <laughs> oh man, some people are hilarious. <laughs> okay, let's take a look at the post-game stats. And let me check something here. Okay, we're on the right page. Wow. No big surprise. Ace tanker. Spotter. How much did he spot? The game's still running. 2,187 assists. Wow. <laughs> Bruiser, duelist, fighter, fire for effect, confederate, and high caliber for doing 4,638 damage with an E25. Comes out first in damage. Wait, what did I do that just there? Uh, that, that's kills, sorry. First in damage, um, second in kills. Kudos to the Poodle for killing five guys. Well, not bad. He helped also. And 1,918 base XP. What's your total, buddy? 4,891 XP. Very nice. And even though he spammed APCR, he still made credits. Very good. Very good. And I think you had a premium consumable. Let me check. Yeah, the chocolate. Nice. Very, very nice, my friend. Amazing. I really enjoyed watching this replay. Probably one of the best E25 rounds I've ever seen. You got lucky there on that M6. I don't know. You don't know what happened. He disconnected. His mother called him. His girlfriend called him. Whatever. Something He something happened there. Come is disabled for this replay. Well, I know the reason. Because we have a, a super gentleman who comments on, um, on uh, watch replays. Put them on what record? Put them on what record? That, that SOB is, is not on what record? Okay? Anyway... Oh, uh, yeah, 
I'm going to keep it just one video for today because I'm very, very, very busy these days doing other stuff. And you guys are awesome. Take care. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.